For each course where you wish to use Panopto recordings, you're going to need to add the Moodle Panopto block to the course. So what we do first is go into our course and there click here this yellow icon that says Course Tools. Now we're in our Tools area. If you click Edit Course Blocks, you'll be able to add a new block to the course. So I've clicked, scroll down to the bottom and we see add a block, open that up and select Panopto. And there's the Panopto block, it's um, adding itself, it says it's fetching the content. Now. Here it says this course has not yet been provisioned. Provisioning means that a link needs to be made between Panopto where there will be a folder for the videos for this course and a list of the people who are enrolled in this course and so they can access that folder. So we're going to provision the course and it will tell Panopto here's the name of the course and here are the students and teachers in that course. So it says here successfully provisioned. Let's go back to the course. All right, we want to finish. We're done here once that uh, provisioning has happened. Here's the Panopto block. When you record, there'll uh, be a link here where it says completed recordings. There'll be a link right here to those recordings. The first time you do this, you're going to want to download the recorder, and one of the ways to do that is to use either of these links, Windows or Mac, but you can also uh, download directly from Panopto. So we're done. We have the block in place. So up here, and it's a little hard to see, turn editing off right up here under the name of your course. Click that, and we're back to a normal view for the course. When you want to record in Panopto, you need to open the Panopto app on your computer. I've already downloaded it, so here it is in mine. And I'm going to sign in. Let me pull that down. There we go. I'm going to sign in. And I have to do so at the server where Panopto hosts our UNO account. And here's the name for that. UNODL.hosted that dot panopto.com so you'll paste that in where it says server then you click providers and from the list choose Moodle log in with your Moodle credentials and anything now that you do in the Panopto recorder will be saved in your Panopto account.